What's up, church family? Welcome to this week's announcements. First of all, we want to thank you. As a church, we are seeking to do great things in this community through the love of God. Often the leadership of this church has asked you, the church, to step up in one way or the other. We are a church that serves. We are thankful for the way you time and time again step up and make the ministries we are seeking to run a success. For example, recently we put out a request for helpers for the new breakfast program we are doing at Blundell Elementary and for more helpers for the community meal we run on Saturdays. We the church stepped up and many of you volunteered. We are so thankful for you and we are excited about what God will continue to do through us as a church. So thank you. This week for our Sunday evening service, Farouz, our young adult ministry group, will be running the service. It will be a special service and instead of a sermon, we will be looking at the theme of mental health. Everyone from every aid group is invited. As a church and a charitable organization, we are responsible to the laws of Canada. The government has brought in some new policies that have made it necessary for organizations such as us to revamp our constitution. These changes don't in any way affect our beliefs or practices as a people of God. But what this means is that the board has been hard at work using this opportunity to give our church's constitution a needed revision. There are copies of the draft constitution available at the welcome table in the foyer. If you consider yourself a part of this church, please grab a copy after the service and have a look through it. Attached to the document is contact info for the board to email questions or suggestions. We take who we are and what we do very seriously, so thank you for your assistance in this. Well, that's all for now. As always, check out the bulletin and the church website for more info. And have a great week, church family.